Welcome to the Elective Rotation Podcast, Critical Care Pharmacy Minute, where I discuss one critical care pharmacy thought in about one minute. I'm Pharmacy Joe of PharmacyJoe.com. How should you dose methylene blue for the treatment of acquired methemoglobinemia? Acquired methemoglobinemia is typically a reaction to medications. The ferric hemes of methemoglobin are unable to bind oxygen, therefore causing a functional anemia. If the met hemoglobin levels are 20% or higher, or the patient has symptoms of impaired oxygen delivery, including tachycardia, confusion, tachypnea, seizure, or coma, this is a medical emergency that requires prompt treatment. When in doubt, bring the methylene blue to the bedside immediately when met hemoglobinemia is suspected so that it will be available if needed. Methylene blue accelerates the conversion of methemoglobin to hemoglobin, effectively reversing the functional anemia caused by methemoglobinemia. 1 to 2 milligrams per kilo IV over 5 minutes of methylene blue should be given immediately if the methemoglobin levels are 20% or higher or the patient is symptomatic. The dose can be repeated in 1 hour if needed. Remember that administration of methylene blue will render standard detection of met hemoglobin inaccurate. Most patients will improve rapidly and not require any further treatment. For more on the treatment of met hemoglobinemia or inpatient medical emergencies in general, check out my book, A Pharmacist's Guide to Inpatient Medical Emergencies at clinicalpharmacybooks.com.